Hello friends, this is your girl Goldilocks here and we are back for another gift wrapping tutorial. Now, if you look on the far right of the screen, you will see a lovely gift basket. So, if you like that gift basket, which I think you guys really did based upon the response to the video, you're gonna love this gift wrapping tutorial because it's literally along the same theme. So please make sure you watch the video to the very end so you can see the final look. And if you like any of the decorations in the background, then check out the description. All the links will be there for you, okay? So let's get to this gift. As you can see, I am just wrapping it up. Of course, you can use a non-square box to wrap up your gifts, but this effect is really gonna do the best on a square box okay and as you can see there's our lovely wrapping paper isn't it nice oh my gosh this actually um came from amazon it's in a three pack fyi so three different uh wrapping papers and they're actually kind of not as long as normal wrapping paper which i like so maybe not best for like a huge box but like for your medium uh to small boxes perfect 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 paper really high quality link will be in the description you're gonna love it so while we're finishing wrapping this gift please make sure you hit the like button always hit the like button when you come in the door and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already guys okay and please make sure you guys are following me on both TikTok and Instagram. My name on both platforms is exactly the same. Goldilocks does that. If you need a little help, again, a link is in the description. Excellent. So let's finish up wrapping this box here. And once we get to the next part, I'll come back. excellent uh all done with that looks so pretty oh my gosh like honestly you could just use this paper by itself and you would be good but you know we we can't be ordinary we gotta be extraordinary so we're gonna add some razzle dazzle there so as you can see i have this decorative heart now believe it or not this heart is like like on a stick so i don't know what you would do put it in the ground or something put it in your plant uh, and I just broke that stick off the bottom. Now be careful when you do that. If you do that, got that stick at um, Dollar Tree, by the way, uh, because it's very delicate. It's basically styrofoam with sprinkles on it, so it can break off. So just be careful when you're removing the stick. And yeah, here we go. So we're putting some rhinestone ribbon. Like I am literally in the creative process as I'm doing this. So I couldn't decide if I wanted to use the light pink rhinestone ribbon or the silver ribbon but ultimately i just decided to go with the light pink because i just thought it was so pretty and it complemented this package really well so this ribbon i have here was actually a little short see look <laughs> it was from pre-cut ribbon but i just thought it it could still work because i really didn't need ribbon in the background for uh, my ornament my heart there so what i end up doing is just super gluing it to the front and just left the space where there would be space for the part see as you can see there i have the space and voila i just put the heart over it and it it went really well so i didn't need that extra ribbon there i mean you can if you want to to help it you know attach but i didn't need to wasn't necessary for me and again so for my second ribbon again i decided to go with the light pink ribbon i was thinking about going for the silver women or excuse me silver ribbon but i decided nah let's keep it uh congruent let's keep it the same so that everything flows really well plus this like <laughs> this light pink ribbon was so freaking pretty i loved it i got it from amazon again 
link will be in the description. I want you guys to have access to all these materials so you can imitate them and be fabulous. So what I decided to do was similar to what I did to that gift basket in the background where I pulled the ribbon through. Now with the other gift basket, I actually made a bow and then pulled the bow through the heart. But this time I kind of decided to do something different. Like instead of making a bow, I was just going to secure the ornament, the heart to the package, okay? And I thought this was like a very, very elegant thing to do because I just didn't want too much volume with this. Like I want it to be fabulous and stand out, but we also don't want something that, that's like too big and sticks out. Like it needs to like flow and look good and look elegant otherwise it's gonna look bulky and gaudy and crazy and we don't want to be any of those things we want to be the life of the party we want to steal the show so we can't steal the show if we're looking a hot mess okay so anyway after i pulled the ribbon through literally all i did is tie the ribbon in a knot and then pull the two um i don't know what you call them pieces uh strands through the ornament and now what am I doing is I'm just taking some hot glue and I'm gluing this part of the ribbon behind the first ribbon that I attached to just kind of hide you know just kind of hide it and just like make everything go together like a bandage dress <laughs> I don't know if you guys remember those from like the early 2000s but they were everything and this is exactly what the back of this package reminds me of is a bandage dress so that's how we're gonna make it look and again I just used the hot glue for the first side and the second side was actually like a little long so I'm gonna cut it um, so that it can easily fit behind the first ribbon without like overlapping or creating too much bulk because again we want everything to flow nicely look how pretty that um rhinestone ribbon is like i just love rhinestone ribbon and like usually this rhinestone ribbon comes in like a hot pink but this is like a really soft like demure pink and it just I don't know it just does it for me okay see if you look at the gift basket in the back i use the silver ribbon totally pretty lovely i mean as you can see it's shining and sparkling blinding me over here but this light pink rhinestone ribbon i don't know it just does something for me it's so elegant with the wrapping paper it just goes together look at that oh do you see how easy that was to make your gifts absolutely beautiful and shine like look at that oh my gosh look how pretty it is and that hot glue is awesome if there's any extra strings just pull them off like i did and look how well it just stands up no problem at all and this is our final look guys look how beautiful that is oh my god if you try this if you try this please post it on social media and tag me in it so I can be like, yes, you did that, okay? And also, guys, make sure you follow me on social media. You can find me at Goldilocks Does That on TikTok and Instagram, okay? And I will see you next time.